like the things that podcasts are a form of entertainment, as I'm sure you're all aware. They are typically people or a person talking about topics that happened during the week, or something that's happened in their lives. Typically, but it's not. It's typically during the week. Um, and I've started to listen to podcasts again. And um, the podcast, well, podcast I listen to is the Misfits podcast, hosted by Fitz Swagger Souls, Toby on the Telly, Zuggles McCreamy, and I Notorious. Um, it's a good podcast, and um, I watch it because it, it, it's a funny podcast. I will admit it, it's a very funny podcast, and um, it has interesting and slightly strange topics. I'd say some of the topics that they talk about are like just weird things that they think about, and then they just talk about it for like twenty minutes, which fair enough for them. And um. And I was thinking about talking about some of the topics they talk about in my own videos. So it isn't direct, but it isn't plagiarism. Because it's just topics, but as long as I don't probably go through it, what I say, then it should be fine. Um, so, yeah, I'll, but there was one topic that I was just going to make the video on, but could, well, didn't because the title would have just been pretty much a title of their podcast. And it was it was talk of them talking about bonsai humans, and there's a brief summary of it. Pretty much, like they were talking about ways to like pretty much how you grow a bonsai tree, and using that same technique of growing a bonsai tree to pretty much just grow small humans or dwarfs, pretty much. Really interesting. Wait, like you know. All I'm saying is, can you just can you just raise a b- little bonsai human? Well, think yeah, about sure, it. Sure you can. <laughs> think, think about it. A little like body cast that like restricts his growth. Just gotta trim them every time he grows. And like them they don't human. they don't look quite like a dwarf, but they're just very small. Very small. Well, like imagine me, but I'm just like small. Have you ever seen those <laughs> fruits <laughs> where, where they grow an apple inside a glass shell yeah. that's, a, that's in a shape? And then yeah. they, you get a square well, apple. Well, they well, they like, like doing glass watermelons and shit. No, I'm just saying you could do that with a human. And I was there and I was listening to it just walking to school and I was like, you know what, if someone actually done this, it, it obviously wouldn't be allowed at all. But that would be pretty funny if you just see people just walking around the street, four foot one, oh, why are you four foot one? Oh, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a creation of a bonsai human. Like, imagine that's how you introduce someone. It's just, oh yeah, hello, I'm a bonsai human, don't mind me. That would just be, that would be strange. And the, pretty much the topic that they also talk about was like square apples and like how you get square fruit and stuff. And they run by like if you could use the square, like the things that they use for square fruit and stuff, like the cages around it. If you could make like people's heads square or perfectly circular or like different shapes just by putting it in this thing for like the childhood just so it pretty much forms around the glass container or whatever container so that when they are like like so when they're growing up then the head just forms around it which i was there i was like you know what that's fair enough but who on earth in a sane mind would do that to a child like obviously putting the glass around the head like if they want the child's head to be a certain way go for it but no one would want to have like a decahedron as a head like a dodecahedron as a head no one would want that just stick with the normal base structure as the the head or head structure as a head structure you don't need to go into making dodecahedron heads no one wants a dodecahedron head. And if you want a dodecahedron head, what is wrong with you? <laughs> also, why was the first one, the first shape that I thought about was dodecahedron? Is that just because it, it's just a fun word to say, to be honest? It's just, I just really enjoy the word dodecahedron. I don't know why. Um, but yeah. 
Oh, yeah, I also got 169 win streak and then died to freeze in midair when someone triple shot spammed, which I'm very sad about. Which I'm very, which I'm very sad about. But hey, I'm not bad anymore. I was just gonna put like a 10 second video of just of me celebrating, but I thought I would just include it in this video as a little side topic to the podcast. Um, so yeah, I was listening to their podcast. I was like, you know what? Some of this stuff I could talk about. So that's probably what I'm gonna do. If if you listen to them, then you hear a lot of correlations between what I talk about and what they talk about sometimes. But that's also just depending on if I decide to do the topics they're talking about as videos. So I'm not just gonna be like, oh yeah, the only topics I'm gonna talk about is the topics they do, because then that would just be very unoriginal. I would honestly, honestly, I wouldn't want to do it myself, just because it would just not be time-consuming, but it would just lack a lot of creativity in like the YouTube space. So like, they they upload a podcast on Spotify, I listen to it, and make a video about it. Boom! Like, come on, that's just very uncreative and I am an uncreative guy but I'm not stupid to the levels of stealing of the topic ideas and pretty much the entire podcasts off of very successful people that actually have eventful lives and can talk about them. Um, so yeah I was thinking about that and the podcast itself would I recommend it? Probably both yes and no because some of the topics that they do talk about are they're not they're not like they're not suited for younger audiences you could say but, but, but quite a lot of them you could watch as like well could you it depends what your family would think if they allow swearing cussing or like if they allow their the parent to watch it whenever but I, I wouldn't recommend it for anyone who doesn't do that stuff. But, yeah, but if you live in a home that just doesn't care about what they talk about, just doesn't really care about, like, if pretty much if you just not, if, you, if you're a snowflake, I wouldn't recommend watching or listening to them. Um, because there are some pretty. It's Everything's done in humour, but it isn't serious, obviously, but uh, there's also some people that are like, mm, they said this, mm, this is bad, uh oh, no, 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 you can't be saying this, no, 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 but um, yeah, it, it's a good listen in my opinion, and that's just my opinion, so if you enjoyed this type of video, instead of me just commentating over a stream, I like to think, um, make sure to like, subscribe, comment, do whatever you want to do, and um, yeah, that's, that's another video. Bye.